Ladies and gentlemen, after months of waiting, we finally get a fresh new Miner's Ethan update. That is right, we are getting a fresh new Miner's Ethan summer update. Oh my gosh, I'm hot for it. So the update will launch in two weeks on Sunday, May 28th. Too bad I'm on vacation there. Uh, then yeah, it, it's a shame. It is a shame. I will still still try to make videos maybe on my phone. I will see. I will see. So anyways, let's get through it. PvP. It's a huge update by the way, but who remembers PvP? Oh my god, PvP, what was it? Oh yes, I remember. In the beginning of Miner's Heaven, there was PvP. You could just kill other people, you could get a badge with it, you could get items or items. Well, you could steal someone's uh, research points. It was crazy, it was a huge thing back in the days, but Barrasso removed it because he said Miner's Heaven is not a fighting game, it's a building game. So something, he said something like that. Anyways, here we go. PvP is coming back to Miner's Heaven. New weapons and gear. Yes, folks, that's right, my mini gun. Oh, 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 who's getting ready to get his ass kicked by my bad ass mini gun? Okay, new weapons and gear giver items will be introduced. Player will now be able to kill each other on the map while searching for the many new treasures it has to offer so i think there will be something like i don't know i have no clue to be honest maybe there will something drop a box or something with with something special in it you see or a lot of boxes i don't know and uh people can fight for it to get it i don't know we will see most weapons will not be able to harm you on your own base however you will still be able to harm others uh this is interesting so basically if you stay on your base uh, other people can't harm you, so you can die if you stay in your own base. But you can't shoot other people, so yeah, it, it's when you yeah. So it's basically the old PvP system, but without getting spam killed, which is an okay thing. But the problem is, uh, if you are in a fight, they can just run back to their base and they're safe. So it, it, it's a, it's a thing. Okay. Anyways, the range of undead guardians, yeah, it's it increased with the, all the swampy stuff, zombie stuff. Anyways, next thing, new items. Who doesn't love new item, folks? That's right. We're getting new items. Twenty. Crazy new shop items, and I already reviewed some of them. Just check out uh, the video of the review of them. Uh, I will put a link in the description af after you watch this video, of course. Then you can check it out. And don't forget to hit the like button. Okay, uh, blah, 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 blah. Two new reborn fusions. I still don't have the other two new ones. What? A new reborn and sleep stream items coming for those still hiking up to life 1000, which is a great thing. After life 1000, you weren't able to get sleep stream items anymore. So, okay, thank you, Barassa. And also, this is the most exciting thing. The second sacrifice. What? The second sacrifice, that is right. After Barassa released the first sacrifice, only days after, people were already asking him, Will there be another sacrifice? Are you able to do it again? What will it be? And finally, it is here, the second sacrifice for the crazy few that have performed. I'm already live as 1000, so I can also do it. Um, you're not done yet. The second sacrifice can be formed at live as 1000 or higher. That is right, I can do it. Whew, I don't have to go to live 2000. Reboarding is so boring. Re boring. Ah, okay, no, that, that joke was bad. That Okay, get out of here, Lisa. Um, <clears throat> You start over with all your reborn vintages, exotics, and ultimate items. Wait, you, oh, without, yeah, okay, without, yeah, just the same as on your first ultimate sacrifice. In fact, you start with nothing but a furnace and basic iron mine. Um, so you, basically, the first time you did the ultimate sacrifice, you started off with the ultimate sacrifice item after you did the ultimate sacrifice and the other items were locked away. But this time, when you do the second ultimate sacrifice, uh, you won't get that second ultimate sacrifice item yet. You will, it will be locked till life S10. So you gotta reborn nine times before you're gonna get it. Oh no, it's called S plus 10. Oh, S minus 10. So S minus number and this is S plus number. Okay, cool. You received the, received the final upgrade and item so epic and obscenely powerful that you have to see it for yourself. So, I'm wondering, will you get the ultimate sacrifice item and this new second sacrifice item? Will they be combined? Can you use them both? Is it gonna be like 
and the overflow device and true overflow device that you can only use one or are you able to use both items that will be crazy i don't know what i hope it's going to be an upgrader we don't want to mine our furnace that's terrible that's terrible anyways there will be a leaderboard in the middle okay cool cool ranked how high their life is well yeah yeah leaderboard i don't know i don't know leaderboard I think it will be more fun if they added a leaderboard uh, with like the highest money someone could get. <laughs> oh, with like the people that got high. No, no, that would still be lame. That would still be really lame. I don't know, a leaderboard. It's not something in Miner's Heath. I don't, yeah. Okay, but you gotta do whatever you gotta do. And little things, finally some other good things that you can expect. With every big update. Okay, so first, new summer team map. Oh, yes, we are getting a new map. I hope this is going to be a good map for the Crate Storm. So now if you buy Crate Storm, you got to walk around a huge hill in the middle of the map to get your crates. And they disappear after like 20 seconds or so, which is annoying. You pay for a crate that will disappear. Okay, so uh, hang around to rear in the center. Secret treasure. Okay, okay, okay. New six minute. Okay, I don't really care about uh, background music, anyways, because I got my Roblox sounds off. But this is it. This the day has come that Roblox blessed us. Bressa himself blessed us. Inferno boxes unrigged. What? <laughs> I don't believe it. We first got to see it before you know we we were getting hyped. Because last time Beresa said he was going to unrig those boxes, they were even rigged more. So, okay, Beresa, we are really excited about this. But please, make it come true. We really want it. Okay, anyways, uh, the last thing we got is the exotic day. This will be one day before the update on 27th of Ma May. Um, yeah, the exotic day. And basically what it is going to be, it is just going to be a day that you're able to get every exotic that was ever made on Miner's Even. Exotics are basically, if you're new to Miner's Even, items that you're only able to get for a certain amount of time. For example, uh, an exotic, an item that you can get out of boxes only during the summer vacation or only during Christmas. Something like that. Exotics, uh, items you are only to, able to get a certain amount of time out of boxes. But now Barres is going to add all exotics in the boxes on exotic day only for one day so if you're everybody don't open your box yet save up your box everybody save up your boxes till this day it's gonna be huge it is gonna be huge i want to get some exotics i don't have yet i want to get a texicator who remembers the texicator oh my gosh texicator op item i don't have yet i want to get a spook master 5000 i don't have it yet and um Ooh, there was another item. It's like uh, the lava thing or the Volcango. The Volcango, I also want to get the Volcango. So I'm going to save up some boxes for the day. And I hope I will be able to get like those three exotics. I really, really want to get them. You should do the same. So don't open your box yet. Wait for this day to come and you're able to get all the exotics in Miner's Eve. And the rest of effort added. It's going to be huge. Let me know in the comment section what, uh, what exotics you want to get on this day saturday 27th uh when i'm on vacation when i am on vacation it is it's true it's sad so that's basically it uh but before we end the video i will do a 12 hour stream this saturday saturday i will do 12 hour stream it's gonna be huge basically what we're gonna do we're gonna go on a new account um lace1785 challenge 26 we're gonna go on that account and we're gonna try to do the ultimate sacrifice it is like 25 at the moment but we're gonna go for ultimate sacrifice i hope i'm able to do that or at least like uh 300 or so let's see if we're able to do that it's gonna be huge saturday make sure you be there i have no time for it yet but i will put it probably in my next video or on my twitter just make sure you be there anyways thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit the like button and if you love this miners even update news it is coming soon and i'll see you on my next video. See ya!